Gemini. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I am going to do your weekly general reading for the week of August 27th to September 2nd, 2018. Those of you that have recently subscribed to the channel, thank you guys so very, very much. I truly appreciate you guys so much more than you will ever know. So I truly thank you for that. If you have not yet subscribed, Gemini, please be sure to click the red subscribe. Also click the bell so that you get notified when I post your readings, go live, all that fun stuff. For you guys, I am using the easy to read tarot. This will be for Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs. As a reminder, if the reading doesn't resonate for you, please watch your other signs. Those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram for morning dailies. They are videoed per element. Check them out. You guys will absolutely love them, I promise. Instant go if you would like a question answered. Facebook Live every Monday. Links to everything that you guys need are below the video in the description box. Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Two of Cups fell out for you guys. So either um, new relationship, partnership, those of you that are coupled, could be, you know, deepening your relationship, taking things to the next level. Partnering up in business with someone. Never know. Nine of Pentacles, Five of Swords in your foundation, Recent Past Clarifier, Temperance, Crowning You, the King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Male, Sag here, and the Six of Wands. Wow. Some of you have worked very, very hard and you're on the path to starting something that's very successful. And it looks like, it looks absolutely amazing and financially very, very successful. Some of you are dealing with an earth sign. Virgo Taurus Capricorn. Some of you males, others of you females, but some of you are single, others married, coupled, whatever. It really doesn't matter. You know, the, you guys really, especially if you have earth in your chart, like two, I mean, you really look amazing. But the King of Pentacles, he feels coupled, partnered. The nine of this feels single, the nine of pentacles. And temperance in the past, you know, in the past, some of you were dealing maybe with the Sagittarius. This is also imbalances, probably with your finances, your money. But now things are literally, like, growing. And then everything is, like, growing. A lot of growth around you financially. Things are getting more solid, stable, secure. You're feeling more secure. In your foundation, you know, you definitely had some difficulties, had some challenges. You know, this is... You know, fights, arguments. This is someone, you know, this person will literally tramp, trample, stomp all over you. You, them, you know, 
to get what you want. You know, this is definitely someone that takes action and does what they need to do to reach their goal. They could be a Sagittarius or an air sign. But I feel like this is you if, if you have Earth in your chart. You know, getting ready to do something, to take action. Now, the King of Pentacles, this could even be your boss, a family member, friend, co-worker, partner, something. And you have, you have so much success here. This is getting noticed at your job, you know, getting a raise, promotion. Some of you are, some of you are really making a lot of money or are on the verge of it. You really are. You know, after you've gone through just stupid shit, some imbalances, struggles. But really, it feels really good. I like it the way it is. Well, let's clarify. I'm going to use a distant past for you guys. I've been, just like last week, just switching it up, whatever I feel like to. And I'm also going to be pulling you guys... Um, Ethany, E-T-H-O-N-Y. She's here on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Etsy, her bad bitches tarot. They are geared more towards women, but um, absolutely amazing deck. Totally in love with it. I'm going to pull one of them as like a clarifier, guidance, see what comes up. And I really just want to show them off too, you know? <laughs> Five of Swords. All right, definitely this one. Whoa, okay, interesting. Um, that's the Queen of Swords. So I, hey, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do in life sometimes right air signs I love my air signs I think um, I mean vice versa it could be another air sign but either they walked all over you or you walked all over them they played you you played them or she got in the way of your game this person could have gotten in the way of what you were trying to do You know, this person, you know, the Queen of Surgeon, she's upright, you know, very truthful. So I do kind of feel like this person needed to hear the truth about a situation. And you had to deliver it, vice versa. You were getting played, they were getting played by this air sign. It just depends. I'm going to get another card right now there, actually. Oh my God, I cannot believe the Two of Cups just flipped out of this deck for you guys. Because it flipped out for you before. I'm not sure if it was this, because this is the second time. I had to do your, revi your video twice. But isn't that a shame? I can't remember if it flipped up in this one or the one I did a little while ago. It was, it was this one, but regardless, this, this is a love relationship. So someone definitely got played in love and it was probably an air sign, female, by their partner, spouse, you, I mean, this is especially true if you have air in your chart. I mean, you guys, you know, I'm just calling it the way I see it, guys. I mean, this is you. 
coming up. I mean, you're the Queen of Swords. This just feels like you did this. I'm just saying. But maybe not. Let's see the... Nine of Pentacles. Definitely this one. Alright, the Seven of Cups. Wow. Okay. Some of you could have been... You know, we all do it. You know, it could have... I don't want to say this. Some of you could have... Were pretending to, like, have more than what you did. Or maybe, you know, dreaming and fantasizing about all of this success. But regardless of the situation, you end... I mean, again, you look fabulous. You ended up getting it. Dreaming, desire, we all do that, right? Dreaming, desiring, fantasizing, wishing. I see this a lot as wishing. You know, what you're going to do with all that cash. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm going to go to the King of Pentacles. Let's see what that's all about. All right, I'm just going to take them. Um, the Nine of Cups and Justice reversed on this King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and there's you, uh, or Libra, sorry. I just did Libra. I feel like some of you are in the process of getting a divorce or you're telling someone that you're getting divorced or vice versa, they told you that let me look at the Nine of Pentacles again. Definitely this one. The Four of Cups reversed. Some of you are very bored. Like you're trying to figure out what your options are in love. Especially those of you that are single. You know, when you have this amazing, fabulous career going on for you, I am concerned for those of you that got played by an air sign. But again, you know, at the end of the week, you have all this victory and success coming. So whatever it is that you're getting over, I feel like you really aren't getting over it. Them which could be the King of Pentacles and or this Five of Swords. Yeah, you definitely have someone here that got played by someone that's married and by someone that is likely, that is like, you know, saying to you, hey, I love you. They could be female or you. And the female air in your chart. Let me look at let me look at the six of wands. All right, that one fell out. Let me get another one. That didn't flip over.
Okay, the Six of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. This is waiting to see. This is, a, this is definitely a lot of waiting. Let me see what else I get. I mean, this is... Oh, this is a whole lot of waiting. Waiting, 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 waiting. I need another card. Materialism. Um, this is the devil. Some of you definitely um, some of you are looking past materialistic situations and money and just trying to do what you love and being very passionate about what you do. You know, this is that fiery energy, but and also getting a lot of attention. Now let's see the five of swords one more time. Okay, tower. Okay, this, wow. Wow, Gemini. All right, so, um, an air sign female. She could have been shocked to find out that someone was playing her. This, this is definitely you guys being shocked that you were being played, or vice versa. You were shocked to find out that you were being played by this person. cards but they are so small now hold on let me grab one more here okay guys so we have Scorpio Cancer Pisces here female and then we have strength up here Leo I'm so sorry guys but I absolutely feel like you played a female or they played you whatever it is this this is your foundation which brings you to here this was a big shock you're moving forward some of you are moving away from an air sign female and moving forward with a Virgo Taurus Capricorn male or female but you're absolutely getting a whole lot of attention you will absolutely be successful some of you have a Sagittarius in the past so you're definitely moving forward getting over the imbalances if there were any and now I feel like you know you're gaining the strength the confidence the courage you know, and by the end of the week, the beginning of next week, you have success. You have, you know, you're feeling very victorious. You know, after dealing with bullshit, it really is absolutely beautiful. After dealing with a lot of bullshit. Like, that's a whole lot of bullshit. Okay. These are the Bad Bitches Tarot. The cardstock on these are amazing. 
There's like a rose gold tint to them. It is there. You can see it a little bit over here, but really just absolutely amazing cards. And th this, these cards will last forever. Now in a private reading, if you wanted me to use these for you, I absolutely would. going away oh this eight of cups oh geez yeah losing it the eight of cups yeah you're walking away you're moving forward beautiful i love it emotionally moving forward and you look pretty damn happy about it too you're looking to the future you're not looking back you know looking to the future you're done with all this bullshit. That can't be a more perfect clarifying card. Confirming this reading, really. You know, you are you're feeling victorious. And you look victorious. You look stunning. Handsome, too, for my male. See, it is geared more towards women this deck you know it really is and um but it's amazing amazingly accurate too i'm in love with it okay gemini i hope that this reading helps you guys out i will see you guys back here very shortly with the monthlies absolutely love you guys hope you have a fabulous fabulous week i will see you guys back here very very soon till then guys take care